as nochten tang mabang yang ye stall ka nong nochten galir as er la dang tas nang baka na as nang nor na stall nong ya kisisa ayoker ibe ya pork puchia na as er ibe ya chicken pakora galir as er dang ya takan nong yang wotut ba idem je car shows dar na idem je dang as er bo momo galir pork momo as er beverages taka mapa idem amen dang galir dem ya na yang luba sen kisisa Kinang kasi ng sister yung walyer, dasa rodang pa graduate sir kita mo dang kaser, dasa lao dahil kaya lang ang master di pisa sa ang acung balima sa bajagi laya laya niyak tapa mapadam niya. Takam yao Fort Carnival lapukas nong yakam kung nora na lapukum malapuk, dasa takam yao dang first sa sungkum mar na. Tang lapuk pa yaka dito mabu masung bu walyer. Tang nong masung bu ba ano ano ko pizin. ปุ๊บเราบอกซื้ออันนั้นจีเป็นซูงนงได้ชิลาบุกเอาตั้งจีนั่นนางบิสเนสจีคุ้มอภิลมเร่ตั้งช่วงอาอุตส่าตั้ง
who have not yet attended the uh, carnival? I think they should come definitely because it's, I see that a lot of people are having fun. Uh, you should definitely bring your friends because there's a lot of good food, a lot of good products and I see that a lot of people are also winning great stuff at the games. So yeah, they should definitely visit. Okay, last but not least, can you, uh, you know, once again spell your Instagram ID, that the right. store that you run, so that right. if a customer wants to approach you, they can uh, DM you through that? Yes, please. So my store handle name is Stones, Planets and Earrings. Thank you so much for giving Thank your time. Thank you so much. Now let's interview some attendees asking about their overall experience tonight. So, you know, uh, as you step into the evening, what are your expectations uh, for the night? My expectations for the night is for the public to enjoy the carnival as it sort of helps detoxify the stress we've been dealing with, but enjoy responsibly. Also, I'm expecting some variety of activities too. So let's see. Can I ask what exciting activities are you looking forward to participating in? Um, I'm actually looking forward to try the food menus. It's sort of an activity like from the different stalls because last year's food items were pretty good and interesting. So I have higher expectations this year. So uh, after experiencing tonight's event, what's the one memorable thing that stand out as the most memorable for you? Uh, first of all, when I first reached the spot, me and my family, we went around, we took a stroll and we played a few games. We bought some toys for our uh, younger brothers and sisters back at home. And as we were coming back home, one of my friends who we went to school with surprisingly invited me to their Gorkha stall. And in this stall, they shared their local dishes. And here, for the first time, I tried the sel roti and it was very delicious. I think visiting the Gorkha stall shall be one of the most memorable things for me this year. Would you recommend Mokchung Night Carnival to your friends? Let's go, let's go. Yes, I would definitely love to bring and invite my friends to the Night Carnival here in Mokokchong. I came here with no expectations and I just wanted to have fun with my family. And indeed, it was a very lovely and wonderful evening visiting all the stalls. I tried a lot of new food, ate a few local dishes and bought some goodies. And overall, I enjoyed to my heart's content. So to anyone listening, do not miss the Mkokchung Night Carnival and join the crowd. Thank you. So brother, can I ask uh, what's your name and what do you do? My name is Sumit Tamang uh, and I'm a teacher by profession. Okay, how many times have you attended this uh, carnival by now? Uh, this is my first time. This is your first yeah, time? Yeah, yeah. So can I ask uh, with what expectation uh, did you come here? Or what are you looking forward to do this evening? My expectations are pretty low, but it's better that way, you know. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> that's interesting. Yeah. yeah. But I, I'm looking forward to you know looking at all the stalls, uh, having good food, having a good time with my friends, yeah, meet my friends and all. Yeah. That's what I'm looking forward to. Well, uh, I'm guessing that you have you know uh, took a stroll around the stall by now, yeah. since it's quite late by the time. Yeah. Uh, what is the most memorable thing that you have came across? Um, I, the memorable would be... Uh, I think just a good time with my friends, I guess. Because uh, no matter how the, you know, the food is or however the atmosphere is, I think by, by the end of the day, it's just having a good time with friends and all. And uh, cherishing the good memories, I guess. Yeah. That's true, that's true. What do you think Mokchung as a whole, you know, gain from certain events? Uh, I think, yeah, a lot of people gain from this, uh, including the public, but I think for the entrepreneurs, yeah. I think uh, they get more exposure, you know, to show their products, handmade things, and food, and all kinds of things, you know. Games and as well, Games, yeah, true, yeah. True. So, uh, economically, you know, it will help uh, boost, I don't know, the whole community, I guess. And people will also have a good time. So it's a win-win for both uh, you know, public and entrepreneurs as well. Okay, and uh, last but not least, what do you think can be done for you enhancing the overall uh, carnival experiences, maybe in upcoming years as well? Uh, uh, so I'm not the right person to say this, but I think what I would expect in the more days to come would be more uh, family-friendly environment, because it, uh, what I seen thus far is more like 
for the youths, you know, uh, for the young guns, you know. But I think if we focus more on like for everyone, you know, so I think it will be a better for the whole community, I guess. So yeah. I think that Thank you so much for giving us your time. Thank you.